add iron to bus, automate wiring, cable and rotor for spinny thing on bus, quartz for oscillators. That's right, we did a mission up to the top there, didn't we? And forgot to take any mining with them. Ah, I still don't have a fucking pad. So from memory, I actually got the first iron bus working. Sack. I don't remember what it's making, but I think it's making everything that requires only iron. But the other problem is, I've half considered already tearing it down and starting again. No! Well, see the problem that I do I've done, which normally is a problem that I don't do in... Factorio is I've built this parallel, like I've built it in line, that have built it off to a 90 degrees. So all the shit's coming out, and then I have to turn it 90 degrees to go into the bus. Thus minimizing my amount of space. I'm very confused, but I accept. That I was. <gasps> what about I George? Shit. No. No, I have to make shit. How do I make a crystal loss like? Ah, I need a shitload of quartz. Ah, fucking. I was about to say you don't have quartz, do you? That was the big thing that we were trying to. Hey, look, there's. Is that, gym, is that gym... why I went to go get so much quartz? Yeah. Fuck. Ah! You needed some Georges to dig the quartz. Ah, oh, for fuck. Fucking... Actually, it's not too far away from our power plant, is it? So I could just put a big fucking miner down. Was it that type of... it was that type of node, wasn't it? Yeah, it was a node. Yeah, but the... Okay. I think you have to put some floors down or something. You have to put something there to stop the fuckers from the big fucking bastards. Because there was two oh. big spitters, remember? Oh, yeah. Why didn't we build it when we were up there? Did we not have the shit? Didn't have any shit. Yeah, it's, it's always my problem. Still have no shit to be... Alright, that's why I've filled the back of the truck with iron and steel and copper. That sounds seems to make sense. We haven't played this in like a month and I'm trying to figure out what it was I was actually... How I was... Never know what I'm doing. Should do what I'm making! Nice. Collection of slug. That's making reinforced iron plate. Making screws. What? We built this thing off. Oh, here we go. No, maybe it's my mouse. It's not my mouse. Sure, it's not. I swear the hub's off kilter from the rest of the shit. No, here we go. You can do it. You can do it, game. I believe in you. Hey. I keep pressing M. I keep trying to bring a map up to like plan where I'm going and what I'm gonna do. Has that worked for me so far? It's not going well. Oh, 
Oh, that's that triggers me. Every it's. Why is it not telling me that it's like snapping correct? Yeah, that's the problem I was having. It wouldn't snap right. I was trying to align it with um, the main hub thing, and it was always off on an angle. So it doesn't make sense. Do you remember Dying Light? I do indeed. Number two is coming out at the end of this year. Kind of what the movement in this game feels like, except obviously without the parkour either. It's a, a little bit like, um, lack of a better term, sluggish. Not sluggish, like there's momentum to everything. Yeah, that's the momentum, I think. Because you're quite fast. If you get going in a straight line, you do pick up some speed, then you can do quite a big jump. But without that kind of um, momentum's not quite the right word, but yeah, that's the best way to describe it. It's almost an elegance to running around if you're doing it right. Then you smash face first into a wall, and then you just feel like an idiot. I do that in real life. Yeah, me too. So many bruises and cuts in my shins. No idea where they come from. Brain's just stopped registering at this point. Oh yeah, he's fucked himself. Again. Oh yeah. Well, he's gone and cut himself, but we don't know if it's for the depression reasons or he's just an idiot. <laughs> just, just blot all pain like below the knee. Doesn't matter. We'll just amputate from below the knee anyway. Fine. <laughs> Old stumpy. Alright, what am I doing? Uh, I'm gonna go and build a mining node on the court. Which requires. And you will need an ass fucking shitload. Ass fucking shitload of power cables. It wasn't that far away, was it? I reckon you'll surprise yourself. Usually. When you're masturbating yourself. Oh, Jesus, I nearly got myself in the eye. <laughs> Am I going to add to... Add to the to-do list. Oh, they've changed that. Nice. Your room. Oh, yeah. Cable, pipes, wires. Where are my rods? Just Downwards. Steel, copper. Hey. What fans of Georgia? I should take, I should take a George because I need it to build. Need a George regardless. I'll take three Georges just in case. I'm on the hunt for some rods. Come on, people, show me your rods. Still getting. This looks like it's full of rods. Oh yeah. Plate, concrete, wire. Takes 400 rods. Apparently it takes... See, this is telling me a fucking power pole takes copper, rods, and concrete. And... Oh, that's called wire. Alright, no, it makes sense. Well, Ten for the thing. Okay, that should be enough. Do I have enough fuel?
know. I am said it. It's treason. And then you do a fucking no, 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 seven, no, 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 no. seven twenty barrel roll, pulling your lightsaber. In. I mean, yeah. Like, wouldn't you? Yoda fucking drops his walking stick and goes into full matrix mode. 700 years old you reach. Look as good as me, you do. <laughs> and if um, anyone in the future is watching this video and they're like, fuck, he got all that wrong. I'm sorry. Yeah, no, I don't think that's... Is that from the Clone Wars? Is that the... Um, Return of the Jedi? Like when Yoda's oh, dying? Yo, you don't look too well. Oh, but it's 700 years old. Well, I'm going to assume you're right. Ming. What if you win, Ming? Certainly. Part of me wants to make these two straight lines like Factorio, but the other part of me is like, you don't have to, it's not Factorio. But straight lines are pretty. But it requires two 90 degree bends, like, instantly. No. Oh. Like, 90 degrees one way, then 90 degrees back. That's fair. Ah, uh, no. <laughs> Kind of spaghetti. Loves me some spaghetti. Heavy. It's a heavy. It's mum's spaghetti. On your spaghetti, spaghetti. Spaghetti. You ever have like a crink in your neck and you just want to snap it, but it's all like, oh, try any hard, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna. <laughs> I don't ever snap my neck for fear of snapping my neck. It's like, I do, I do it with like, I'll have the biggest fucking headache in the world and then I'll just like, just stretch my neck a little bit and it'll just go bang and then my headache's gone and I'm happy. Mm -hmm. like, one day, that's going to be a nerve, and I'm not going to walk away. <laughs> I can crack my sternum. Sing only quite a horrifying sound for other people. I mean, your sternum shouldn't move. Oh, well, isn't your sternum cartilage? Uh, there is cartilage around it. It is a bone, I think. I think. But yeah, it obviously does move, so... I've never met anyone else who can crack this stuff. So 
someone giving you CPR is going to be in for a rude surprise. <laughs> like, pop. What the fuck was that? Did I just explode his heart? It does sound exactly like one of those fucking CPR dolls there. When you push it down the whole way, it goes click. I'm doing it right, I heard the click. Yeah. So I'm assuming you're physically pushing in on it and not just like stretching muscles around it. Uh, no, I, s I stretch my arms out, or I don't have to stretch your arms, just your shoulders. By pushing my shoulders back, expand my chest, and then it goes crack in a very lovely, satisfying way. Fair enough. Uh, Alright, so I've got two layers of first level shit love first level shit so that's shit that requires only iron shit that requires only coal Should I change the quartz into quartz crystals on site? You just... I have no idea how to tell. It's not like those fucking um, Bob's Angels add-ons where you can just click something and go, what does this do? Man, I still don't know what that add-on is and I need it so badly. Oh, I don't remember at this point. It's probably in like one of the top Factorium mods. Well, I guess there's a lot of them. I don't know something that's really fucking annoying. Trains logistics. I've got it half working. In the sense of, it recognizes the iron. It goes and pulls the iron out. It takes it to the warehouse. It the warehouse to the smeltery. I copied everything down. I made an exact replica, but instead I was using it with silicon. It doesn't recognize the silicon. Interesting. Like, all the numbers are identical. Just, it doesn't want to work for the silicon. Are you sure all the, um, like, greater than and equal to signs are the right way around? That's, that's the mistake I always make with that shit. It, it took me, like, a solid day of fucking around to get it to work. But I made sure I had it all correct way. Copied it yeah. identically, but using silicon instead of iron ore. It doesn't work. Reset the train. Yep. Yes. No, silicon's a uh, bog standard one, though, isn't it? Silicon's not. No, silicon's the um, is in Bob's Angels. You sure? I feel like we got like a. It's like a white barrel, isn't it? No, sil as in silicon ore. Oh. Silicon ores. Yeah, silicon ores, Bob's. Yeah. But yeah, just. I'm thinking of just taking logistics off the thing and doing it school way and just having a thousand fucking trains. That's right. Well, the whole thing was to try and make logistics work. Wasn't it? Yeah, and if I can't get it to work, there's no point to me. Yeah, I just don't have the energy to bother learning it. I'd love to get it to work. Just look at that. Like in like hour long tutorials and shit, I'm just like, ugh. I reckon we'll need a lot of modular frames. No idea. Wondering 
whether I put modular frames on my uh, level one shit, which is actually level two. I want to dick around with the um, what do you call it tractor logistics. You and see, horrendous. Well, the the most logical place to do it is over to the coal, and I just don't think they'll be able to get down this ramp or back up it. And there's only room for one anyway, so. Or I guess I convey our stuff up to the top of the cliff and then tractor it down to us. Oh, fuck you. Eh, no. I'll wait for trains. Build a track. I've never trusted fuck, those AI systems where you build them a little road and they trundle off and they're supposed to follow it. They never fucking do. That from playing with Lego. Yeah. Lego Robotics never did what you needed. <laughs> it tried. It tried real hard. Why is that not wrong? What am I doing wrong? By one. I shouldn't actually need. Will I need just iron ingots on the bus, you reckon? As opposed to... Like, at the moment I've got iron plates, iron rods, screws, reinforced plates. Should I also have ingots? I feel... Yeah, I don't know. I don't, I can't, I'm just trying to think of anything that requires ingots. I think it most of it requires it to be split to plate. Guru, man. Can't not know shit. Shit. Well, I don't know this. And I'm trying not to look too much up on this. Think of those poor little kids that were watching us build a space elevator. <laughs> it's alright, space elevator's not going anywhere.
to listen to some music, but because I'm recording, I fear it's not going to work for me. Music and not record. It's a conundrum. Play it on your phone in the background. Some earpods in my headset over there. get a second computer like a pro streamer think I'm just paid of money <laughs> got a 2080 you could sell that and buy three houses 3080 maybe Fucking quartz or quartz dust, whatever it is. What do we do? I have a feeling we had this discussion about 10 seconds ago in regards to steel. Yeah. I don't think anything's going to take rules apart from quartz dust. Are you in a similar room? I mean, I guess. Unless it, unless it's required for um, alloys. But when you're making the steel, does it require steel plate or steel ingots, or steel ore? Yeah, I don't know. Steel fence so far. Yeah, it's not quite as evil as Bob's Angels. It's not going to halfway down go, oh, you need this ore and it's raw for I know you've just spent ages setting up your awesome fucking foundry. But you need, yeah, so like, oh yeah, after you've done all this iron work and you've got all the iron and steel and steel, osmium steel and all that sort of stuff, you want to make concrete? Yeah, you're going to just need ore. Deck. Just. Oh, oh, that was another thing that Daki was talking to me about in this game is with the uh, transport pipes. The way that it calculates how to use transport pipes is it's your entry speed plus velocity. So if you have an entry and an exit followed by an entry and exit followed by an entry and an exit, you can fucking yourself apparently all right silica and quartz are both made from raw quartz black powder is made from raw coal and raw sulfur even sound of it no, no, I'm scrolling down through the workbench and looking at every single thing we've got. As far as I can see from what we've unlocked so far, those are the two. But I think you're right about the alloys and shit, because we get a couple of... I mean, I guess there isn't a secondary form of coal, is there? I wonder if there's a secondary form of salt. I don't think we, I don't think we got that yet. Screw it. I'll pipe raw quartz back to the power station. Anyway. Well, otherwise I have to sit up here and make a silica and a quartz line. And I'm not doing that at the moment. Till we get the prints. Just never. Yeah, and fucking drone.
I need a bigger fucking hotbar. Uh, you can scroll through it. Like if you look uh, to the left of the hotbar, it says one. I think you can scroll to little like one through eight or something. Ooh, not with those buttons. That is not the button to do that. Ah, bees! Bees! The bees! That's not gonna work, is it? You just have to run back and get the fucking truck. Oh, do I have to do something to the mines? I don't think so. It knows it's mining quartz. Good job, miner. Come at me. On you? Ah, crafty bees. So, just thinking, in my head, developing new bus ideas. Never mind, rubbish, I'll stop. I had an idea, but... Shit. <laughs> the endless hunt for the perfect bus. I found a nerd room. Oh, and stabby things. It's okay, I don't need it. I don't need it. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I said I was leaving! Leave me alone!
So you found, sorry, a Nern root. No need for that. Yeah, if you play Elder Scrolls. Well, yeah. um, there's a plant, an incredibly rare plant, that uh, has a little, like, magical tone that gets louder as you get near it. Collectible item, I guess, in a lot of them. You, or you can use it to make a, a couple of rare potions. And there's something here making a fun noise. And it is defended by an evil bastard. See, I said I'd leave you alone. Hear bees. It's making me paranoid. Ah! Just like you found bees. Hello, bees. Come, come on. I'm not sneezing there. Something up here is breathing very poorly. Oh, it's a spitty guy. That would explain why he's breathing poorly. How? Big spitty guy. No, he seemed to spit more than one spitty thing though. Who's only a little one? Maybe a more advanced little one? Or maybe they've changed the... On oh, a slug. Love slug. Oh, oh, peace! I can't tell if I'm laggy and the bees are hitting me, or if they're doing damage when I kill them. Like, they're exploding juices and dangerous. I feel like I'm not yeah. Disappointing. Oh. Yeah, I think I need to change my north gate. Half this shit's not good. Got so distracted, I lost my track. <laughs> so going to
Why? Why can't shit just? It's so mildly frustrating that things are like mostly intuitive. So when the things that aren't intuitive pop up, it really fucking hurts. Yeah. Interesting. I just had an accident with something invisible. Potentially a land bear. Land bear? A land whale, sorry. Um, no? Well, I mean, I guess it could have been. I've been uh, messing with my noise gate here because it's all like I don't want to just hear me breathing in my recording. And I've looked across, and so many things I've said hasn't actually been captured. Haven't been captured. Yeah, but the noise gate was too low, and it didn't pick up me talking. <laughs> or too high, I guess. What does yellow mean? Yellow means it's running but not active. Is that correct? Yeah. He says confidently. Be incorrect. Usually. It's sort of like an oil painting. Like you look around and it's, everything's just a little bit like an oil painting. If you say so. Sorry, I'm just standing at the top of my tower looking down at our little spaghetti factory. Power poles change anything when they get connected? What? 
do the power poles change when they when they're connected to power? Uh, no, it doesn't look like. Don't know. Sorry. Oh well, it's got it's got the grid information. I just have to hope I've connected everything up. Like some roller skates. Maybe a skateboard. Uh, have you tried crouching? Like sprint then crouch. Oh yeah, you do a mad slot. Especially when you're going downhill. Although it's not working for me at the moment. Are you sprinting for? Always sprinting. Sprinting should be a toggle. I mean, you can sprint forever, can't you? So, you see why it's but if you, need, if, if you need to be more precise with your movements, toggle it off. Yeah. I don't know what I'm doing with my life, man. I'm just fucking feeling about at the moment. Get the bus up and running. But with what? What do you want? Give me the iron. So go and connect the iron up. There you go. Okay. So you don't mind if I take it off of the other factory? Hell no. You don't? Hell no, you don't mind, or hell no, don't do that. Hell, hell no, I don't mind. Okay. The other factory is not producing anything except level 1 stuff at the moment anyway. Oh no, there's one place that's producing a level 2 thing. Though. I want to make a 3-3 three three splitter. We're really worried that trains are going to be disappointed. I feel like I started really enjoying Factory when I figured out how the trains work. I get that. And suddenly the scope of the game just... But apparently there's a lot more of this game that we haven't seen. Oh, hell yeah. I mean, I've smashed through the uh, research bit at the start. Potentially we could have got like a whole bus and everything set up before we even got halfway to where we are now. Now we have to go back and find the line of quartz that may or may not be coming. Did you fuck something up? Well, probably. Is... Let's be realistic here. I'll go and find it first. Unless I can just follow the fucking conveyor belt now. This isn't filling me with joy. A little power. How would you like it to fill me with joy? 
what I'd like to find. Fucking oh, here it is! Change Look at course. that lovely line of quartz. Trundling its way up the yes, elevator. Now I guess I go play with my dick for a little bit and wait for it to start stocking up. That's my favourite thing to do. Stocking up? Yeah. A dick. <laughs> Ooh, my vehicle has health! Interesting, terrifying predicament. I'm relatively sure it didn't last. I also haven't got a clue how to fix it. Spinner. Don't be mean. I love that that's an insult for Brits. You fucking spinner. It's such a great insult. You pelican. Like, like for me, it's like tool. It's not just spinner, like just you tool. <laughs> And then, like, when they're really bad, there's like, no, you're not just the tool, you're the whole fucking tool bag. Tool bag could be a compliment. Because tool bags are useful. I feel like Spanner is saying, you're the wrong Spanner. Like, you're, you're being so useless at the moment that you're the wrong size of Spanner I need, which just makes you pointless. <laughs> I was like, you're a fucking Spanner. It's like, oh, Spanner's are useful. I need a hammer. <laughs> yeah. I need a wrench, and you're a half-inch spanner. Completely useless to me at the moment. Not to say you won't be useful in the future, but right now, I don't care about you. It's not a nice thing to say, I'll be a ducky. <laughs> an unfortunate time. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I hope he realizes. I hope he knows that uh, we weren't actually joking. <laughs> Wait, what? What? <laughs> to be fair, I can't hide in there all night. <laughs> Where were you hiding? <laughs> in the D and D channel. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've just seen that message from Brackens. Checked the fucking D and D channel. Well, was there a D and D one that he left in D and D as well? Was there? I put a message in D and D chat saying um, yeah, Red and Tony are working, um, so there'll be no D and D. But then he posted in the uh, general chat, "Are we going ahead?" So hopefully he looked at the other one. How's it going, Ducky? I'm doing all right, thank you. How are you guys going? Oh, pretty good. good. Looking forward to the weekend. Is the weekend not just an extension of your current unemployment anyway? You fucking know it. But... Now, other things, other feels, people... It feels more acceptable to drink on the weekend. I thought you said you gave up drinking. Ah, to an extent. So what you're saying is I could have been drinking this entire time, and I haven't been uh, because I thought I, I want to not drink out of respect for victory. Oh, that's nice. I was drunk when I was DMing. Well, I was drunk when I was obviously, playing. Obviously, obviously, I was doing well enough that you didn't pick up on it. So, I, I, I had had quite a few hot chocolate and scotches at that point. Yeah, drunk D and D can be fun <laughs> until you get your character killed. Well, Tony gets his character killed. Yeah, Tony got fucked up by that shapeshifter. That was unfortunate. Came back. I mean, you've got two fucking clerics. Like, at this point, um, getting knocked unconscious is not a huge issue. Unless they're both the clerics. Well, you've got healing potions as well. You can just stuff st st the healing potion in someone's mouth and it still works. Force feed them healing potion. 
surprised I didn't kill any of you at level 1, because most of the enemies do like 80% of your health in damage most hits. I feel we were quite lucky with our rolls in our first couple of matches. Yeah, and I got unlucky with my rolls, which worked out. Apart from that fucking crossbow bolt that I took to the chest, holy shit that did some fucking damage. Oh, that was in the... In Dwarven Guard or whatever it was. Who shot you with Nomen Guard. No, yeah, you were level 2, but... Yeah, and that fucker wrecked me still. Don't shoot, I'm friendly. Thunk! Ow! Another chance to test a crossbow. I still love, like, my first thought was to fucking, like, hang her up on something. <laughs> Is there a fucking coat rack or something? You guys were quite restrained. You didn't try and kill her at all. Well, my thought was, we're here to let them, to give them a heads up to not let them die to orcs, so uh, killing them prior to the orcs is probably not a good move. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad you actually went to the kitchen first. Realised they're not actually hot. And the uh, very proud, very literal people by the sound of it. Oh. They are rock gnome recluses. Just meeting other people is not very high on their list of things to do. That's what is it? You've probably obviously noticed, but it's like, once I realized, oh, these are very proud people, I just started complimenting everything. <laughs> but being that uh, when it comes to bartering, they'll be like, oh, this guy's all right. Hey, what? No, what? No. Oh, no. Oh, the problems. Oh, that's been feeding into the wrong spot for too long. Oh, no. You got a mix up on the belt. Yeah. Purge the system. Doing some satisfaction if you wanted to join, Dick. Sorry, how was that? Doing some satisfactory if you wanted to join. Okay, cool. I'm just finishing up eating something. Now join, join in. Is it pussy? Cause you need to share that shit, man. Uh, what if I told you it has bacon on it? Makes it even better. Yeah, that didn't help my argument, did it? I was like, why the fuck aren't any of these producing? I was like, none of them have power. Rookie mistake. Your mistake, bucko. I mean...
feel there should be an easier way of running power poles, and I'm doing it wrong. Press 2. And you can select a power pole to connect to, and it will automatically connect to it and give you the blueprint for a power pole. And then when you place it down, it will give you another power pole. Or, well, it'll um, make like a power I'm pole running... and connect it, and you can just make another one off of that. Like running just power poles in a line sort of thing, like how you do in Factorio. And then you're going back and manually connecting them. Yeah. Yeah, so rather than doing that, go straight to the connector tool. Yeah, so press 2 to get my power line. Yep, so pick a power pole. Yep. Connect to it. Yep. And then look at the floor, and it will automatically have a blueprint for a power pole. Line. Yeah, and then do I need to do that every single time, or can I just keep on clicking? Uh, no, you have to do yeah, that. So I have to look at the power pole again. Yeah, okay. Thought it saves you. An easier way. Saves you from guessing the distance. It will tell you how far until a long power pole goes. Cement. Where's my cement? Can run conveyor belts through water. Probably, not. Probably run them over water if you use the um, uh, the vertical stands. True. Is the nuts the only, like, the lowest, I can't think of the right word I'm looking for here, the smallest amount of screen usage thing you can get? What? Like, when I'm running around and I don't want my screen to be blocked with, like, my fucking sword and shit, is nuts the smallest thing? I mean, I guess. So my nuts are the smallest thing I can hold. <laughs> that wasn't originally a setup for a joke, but I found the joke halfway through it. A builder thing's pretty small. As long as you don't mind a blueprint being around. Yeah, I mind a blueprint being around. Yes, I'd say nuts are the smallest. Are we playing War Thunder at any stage tonight, or should I log in to get my chest now? Log in and get your chest now, just in case. Okay, cool. Go, 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 go. How many days are you up to? Uh, I'd say in a second, I forgot. It's uh, only been 24 hours, but. Yeah, I've got my biggest chest today. What's with demon and big chest and small nuts? Yes, just gonna ask that. <laughs> you right, you feeling alright there tonight, man. <laughs> I might be particularly Randy. <laughs> Estrogen, you'll take. Dude, my um, one of my friends uh made himself a coffee tonight, and he poured this new rum. I don't think it's new. It's called like stolen rum or something. And he poured it in there, and he was the happiest man ever. He's like just sending me messages every minute. He's like, "I'm gonna create a new business. This is so good." I'm like, "Okay, man, cool, right?"
it. Shut the fuck like, down. Cal calm oh, down, okay. dude. Calm down. Chill out. It's just coffee with rum in it. I mean... Doesn't sound nearly as good as hot chocolate and scotch. That's exactly. Fuck it. I've great business venture. If you guys want partners in, we can do this. Just set, set up a. Oh, I'm up to day ninety two. Getting in. No, oh, that's. I'm gonna set up a, a coffee bar, and all of this is just gonna be alcoholic coffees and hot chocolates. Yeah, 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 you're not the first to come up with that, I'm afraid. I know, but live and dream. Hey, I'll come. <laughs> We've just found Uchu the job. Yeah, <laughs> he can be the right. barman. Right. For a second, I wasn't sure if that was just like a statement on how good it sounds or not. <laughs> I was like, um, that guy that I'm watching on YouTube, and they just have random, co like, he had a best of 2020 sort of compilation that I was mm. watching. And one of them was like, he started a story about when he was a kid working in Chick fil A. Yeah. But the story started with, there was this guy that used to come in my Chick fil A, and his mate cuts in <laughs> instantly at that point, going, oh my god, did you still eat it? Oh. <laughs> It was just like, That's this, the speed at which he reacted to it was fucking amazing. That's pretty epic, if you ask me. Oh, fuck, he's funny. And really fucking good with a guitar. Like, he trolls people on, like, chat roulettes with the guitar. It's great. Mm hmm I think I linked it in Discord if anyone watched it. But like, people request a song off him. He hasn't heard it before. He goes onto fucking YouTube, watches it for about fucking 10 seconds, and he hits record on one of his fucking foot pedals, lays down the rhythm. Cycles that and then just goes into the lead. Holy fucking shit. This guy is ballistic. Some people just can't do that. So annoying. How dare they be talented? How dare, <laughs> how dare they spend thousands of hours of their life devoting themselves to a talent that they enjoy? Meanwhile, I'm playing. I understand how you do I'm, I'm sitting here playing a game poorly. But still, then we'll get it. bored of it in three months and go and play something else. And be equally as shit at that one. It's time to get back to Eve. It's not. <laughs> it is, I'm still only ever playing the free version. I'm not putting money in that ever again. You said that last time, but then you. No, I did not. T Man fucking shouted me some premium. <laughs> and then stopped turning up. What was with that? He's like, oh, I'll totally, I'll totally pay for everyone to play with me. Oh my god, everyone's back. It's amazing. And then he fucks off. Yeah. He was there, like, before we started playing it again, he was on every single night, all the time, talking about what he's doing and even how his miners are doing. Oh, I got everyone in battleships, chased this guy to my wormhole. And all that. And then we start playing and he just doesn't turn up. Oh, hi, man. Huzzah. What have you guys been doing? Um, Amazing. just looking at this boss and wondering, like, I have ideas on how to improve it. Mm -hmm. But I'm just trying to figure a, a neat way of doing so. How's your power going? What are you using for power these days? Coal. Uh, Coal-fired power station over by the waterfall. Oh yeah, I see the path. Next <laughs> to uh, Demon Loves Cock. You see that up there. Oh yeah. I mean, that works. You bet it does. Where's... Yes? Sutra done the tractor. 
Utrid is yeah. indeed on a tractor. Farmer Utrid. I keep losing it. <laughs> I just went and plumbed in a conveyor belt all the way up to the courts. I just want splitters like Factorio. I want a two in, two out, not a three in, one out. Make life so much easier. Mm. Been too steep. Fuck you, game. Alright, what can I? What can I do, guys? What? Give me a. Give me a task. Well, there's a particularly sloppy blow job that I owe Uhtred, so if you want to get on that for me, it would be great. <laughs> Uhtred, stay where you are, oh, buddy! No! Did that hurt? Did you f Yep. I mean, I... Yes, it did involve the blow job. Ow, I fucking... You slut. You fucking... What are you doing down there? Sucking. I mean, Uhtred's over there! Wrong sort of sucking. It's a talented... Good. What the f you bastard. <laughs> you fucking bastard. Oh, I'm lying. Ah! Uh, you can help Demon hook up the iron and shit to the bar. Alright. Oh. Really? I'm Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm working, <laughs> I'm going through a process, man. <laughs> I thought you were actually going to drop me down again, but it's... But the floor stopped. Sorry, I'm, like I said, I'm just working through a situation oh. here, and I have a feeling this is not going to work for me. Ooh. You do you, man. No one else will do me. Richard? I don't know if he's that keen. I mean, he was pretty fucking keen to receive his reward the other night. Hey, receiving's one. Yeah, you can close <laughs> your eyes, that could be anyone. Sounds like, he's, sounds like he's getting one right now. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, question, uh, you guys... Wait, you're up to coal. What's... Oh. Which... Sorry. Uh, oh, there it is. I've got to remember the key binds and things. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, mm -hmm. I got a bit obsessed with the... Uh tech tree stuff so That's i have urgent. dedicated my my life to advancing the tech tree so our tech level is far beyond any of our like production capabilities hmm. so how much power do you guys have to play with or are you guys borderline i think we got a sizable buffer now we want to chuck to second Coal thingy. Kidoki doki. By a second, I mean five more. Oh, the spaghetti. It's so sex me. Yes, we've got like 200 megawatts buffer. Nice. I think that will include the um, bio things you set up for us as well, which half of which are unfueled at the moment. Oh, cool. <sighs> okay. Earth. Earth. Damn, that is a sweet earth. <laughs> <Damn>. Wrong. <laughs> Classic. When I'm 70, I'm still going to remember that. <laughs> Vividly.
<laughs> so this path over here goes to a coal station, right? Over near the waterfall? Yeah. Sure. Wait, the path near the waterfall mm -hmm. goes up to a crash site. Oh. Uh, if you want the coal station, you want to head almost directly north from the base to, towards the Demon Loves Cox line. Okay. And then there's that little, like, lagoon. You'll see the power pole. You can probably get to it through the route around by the waterfall, but it'll be a roundabout. I got myself a task. I got to, I got something to do, boys. What are you gonna do? Secrets. That's actually not really. I'm gonna help you guys with topple our power. Uh, mm, I could actually. Let me just research how far away nuclear is. <laughs> yeah. I was watching a dude make nuclear, and he accidentally rerouted his nuclear waste back to his base, and it all become irradiated. <laughs> it was wow. funny. When you get, like, tier 5 belts, these things just hone. <laughs> Alright, so... It's not pretty, but it works. It sucks that I had to make this whole complicated contraption for something that Victoria could do in a 2 by one slot. Mm -hmm. Fuck you, this game. Are you guys making advanced stuff at the moment? It's uh, not being produced anywhere that I can think. Okay. You can make it. Where would I find copper? Follow the copper. Following copper. Constructor so slow. I'm making four. Oh, no. Oh, I know. <laughs> Can't pick up these leaves. Yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, I love it. Seems to spawn all the leaves back in, but they're not actually collectible anymore. La sigh. What are you currently constructing over there, sir? Am I in anyone's road over here? I don't know, but I don't think you have the correct permissions for building on that land. Uh, have you been to your local council often? Do I have to suck Uhtred off? Uh, no, this one's a demon suck off, I'm afraid. Oh my god, fuck! Um, hmm. um, you go to work with him, so <laughs> that's happening on Monday. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I just jumped off a cliff. That hurt. <laughs> Trying to get suck out him of off, it. you jumped off a cliff. I get it, man. I would jump off a cliff before sucking me off. <laughs> what is it that you're constructing, sir? I am going to set up a hypertube network. Oh, oh, fuck, he's a champion. Well, I didn't want to intrude, and if you guys are wanting to do that, then I can stop, but... No, oh, go for it. Just, just as long as you give us like a basic idea on how it works, so if we wish to expand it, we can. Oh, fuck yeah, I'll show you how it's yeah i'll construct what i'm thinking of constructing and then i'll show you what it does yeah easily but i think this is all the room i should need I'm researching frequency mapping and the reward is a map uh. that's good also why is this not spawning uh-oh what happened? Ew, clearance issues. Is it this bush? Demon! Can you come down here and harvest your bush? God damn, trim your your... bush. <laughs> Don't. We can both play this game. <laughs> oh no! Mine's very expensive, don't do it! <laughs> I can't believe it took me that fucking long to figure it out. I'm like, oh, I might not have permission to build here. Like, legit, it might... I, I'm gonna go home and cry. What? What? I'm confused. I'm sitting up on top of a bus deleting all the shit he's building. Literally, <laughs> I'm building stuff and I'm turning around and shit's not being built and I thought that it might have been like an admin thing that I couldn't build for some reason. No! Uh, uh, fucking demon deleting shit! <laughs> I God. may have been uh, crying laughing myself then. That was uh, pretty funny from my perspective. That's gonna I'll... be the new, um, new annoyance rather than the whole make the... someone else's bots build a conveyor belt to drag them away. <laughs> I forgot how good that was. You're just like, oh, go FK, and then you come back and you're like fucking 300 meters down the road. <laughs> Have you played Factorio, Jackie? Uh, no, I've seen a bit of it, but I've not played it, no. You get far enough and you get these little robots that will take stuff from your inventory and set them down when you put a template in. Yeah. You wait till you get to that point and then you build a template that's just conveyor belts. And then you stamp it on other people and their bots will jump out of their inventory and build the conveyor belt and take them away from whatever they're trying to build. <laughs> it's great fun. God damn it, I'm listening to Irish pub music again. I can barely hear what they're saying, but it's catchy. I could. It's close. They're such a happy bunch. I mean, I'd be happy too if I was perpetually drunk, but. Clearly they're onto something. They're the next evolution. We must follow them. <laughs> Smart girl. Uh, Can I geez. decrease the power of my propulsive propulsor? Because it's launching me way too high. And it's causing me can. injuries. Uh, I don't think you can change its... Oomph. I think you can change direction, but that's about it. I thought. You could give it a shallower gradient, maybe. That's Just what I'm gonna create, have to do. Create a backboard. 
<laughs> yeah. You just create a back Bounce ball. yourself off the back foot. Yeah. Three points. You are the ball. Be the ball. Uh, we make him steal. Yes. You're not allowed any. It's too expensive. Um, I think it's all going into a little hangar uh, on the other side of the space elevator. Um, yeah, it's pink. The pink steel stuffs. I can nearly uh, launch myself off the other side then. Um, how can I? It should be. Oh, fuck you! My space elevator is just high enough to be a pain in the butt. Not space elevator. I don't know what I'm talking about. Is anyone? No. Oh. That thing over there. I thought you were shipping it in. No, well, it was going to go to the bus. So I haven't bothered shipping it any further than that. And Rather than ship it all the way back to home hub and then have to turn around and ship it into the bus. Ooh, steel. Hey, uh, yoink. Oh, nice. Memory search. So there's only two things that require steel by itself, isn't there? Which is the steel pipes and the steel beams. Yes, and then you've got encased steel beams and a few other things. Got a map? Oh, oh! How do I map? Z to map. map. Oh my God, Richard, there's a map. Oh, it makes me so happy. I'm not building a map. It's just press Z. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh my God. Oh, oh that's all I Thank you, Map Jesus. Why is it Z? This world is massive. <laughs> Let's do more explore. Our train's good, Daki. Our train's good. Mm. They are. Can't sing a butt. This sounds like this is gonna be a very big butt. Um, you need to. How do you put it? You need to plan it. Um, 
because they go back and forth from a station so they go to A to B B to A A to B like they don't do a circular oh uh, hang on no 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 I think they do do circular now sorry sorry, sorry. circuits I'm pretty sure you can use circuits so when they first got introduced they only went from A to B and then from back from B to A there was only just like a back and forth sort of line but I'm pretty sure now you can do a circuit oh that's right because they introduced the station itself yes yeah so it will go to a station stop unload hits load and then travel along yeah yeah you can create a circuit yep nice um and you can have multiple trains on that circuit providing you don't overload it i think they're good they're good and they're reasonably quick they chew a lot of fuel though ain't gonna lie they they, they literally train the fuel you killerize the train. Why do I want to swap it to a workbench? I don't want to swap it to a workbench. Oh, I can I'll take this. Ooh. Hey, what was that? Can we make it nuclear powered? Like electric trains? Uh, I mean, you can plug the nuclear power plant into the track, I guess. It, maybe. But you can't put nuclear power on the train. I mean, you can put nuclear waste on the train. But we can we can have electric powered trains. Yeah. Yeah. It's it's yeah. You just connect like, a power pole to it. Okay, cool. Because in Factorio, it's sort of like you have to fuel the train as well. I'm pretty sure you can just connect a power pole to it. I've only used trains once, like ever, basically. I set one up and then I was like, oh, this is cool, and then totally forgot about it. Because there's faster methods of transporting shit. But trains are dope as fuck. When you get one set up, it's like, fuck yeah. Now I know what these, all these old bastards do on Sundays when they play with their model trains. Oh, yeah. bees! Run away, bees! How have you got bees on the bus? Now that not on the bus, I'm exploring. Oh. Now that there's a map, I'm going to explore it. Goodbye. <laughs> Is the bus all set up a go? Map. 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 There's a map. Is the bus set up? There's a map. <laughs> I've lost it. <laughs> it's like the but the bus. Plant it's dangerous. There's an object scanner. Are we supposed to be using that on stuff? Objects? Yeah, you can make an object scanner and scan stuff. I think it made this too big. I don't. Said no woman ever. It is an object scanner. You haven't watched enough porn, clearly. Clearly, you haven't seen my history. <laughs> uh, uh. My search history would make a porn star blush. I don't know why I've made this so big. Oh, fuck off. I'm, I'm just exploring. Why does shit want what, me dead? What's just, being produced on the bus, team? Uh, currently, level one shit. Oh, dear God, no! <laughs> Demon's having a time of his life. <laughs> Here exploring is going well. <laughs> this is what Christopher Columbus and James Cook and all all those had to deal with. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> oh, it's a house cat. Oh, it's it's a big house cat. Oh, it's oh, it's a spider. Bigger. Oh, it's, oh, it's a just spider. Oh, <laughs> being chased by a spider. Oh, he's getting closer! I can hear him getting closer! Fuck off! Are you guys at the base? Oh, wait, we've got a map. Just, <laughs> just as a heads up, the knife deals with spiders really easily. Oh, disappointing. 
What about the giant spiders? Can't say I've come across a giant spider yet. Uh, dear. I fell into a cave, dodging a fucking speedy boy. And nearly killed myself with the fall. And as I'm running out of there, it's like, it sounds like there's something trying to stab me. I've turned around, there's like three spiders chasing me. <laughs> oh, jelly stuff's fun. My um, exploring has come to an abrupt halt, and I'm back to finish the boss. That's all right with yourself. Yeah. Where is copper ingots? Hmm. Show me to the copper ingots. Do we have rotors? Ooh, I think we do have rotors actually. Uh, yes, over by the combinator at the end of the spaghetti train. Spaghetti train. Wait, <laughs> oh. There may be a limited supply of those, though, because um, we've started disconnecting iron and shit. So it shouldn't need much. Should. Oh, is that steel? I thought that was copper. That's steel. What? No, that's iron. Oh, that, that's copper. Okay, alright, yeah, never mind. Yeah, copper comes from over the hill. I thought it also steel. Uh, there may be a iron mine over there, but... That's where the copper comes from. The stuff on the ground around the hub's all iron. And then I found more iron up the hill over near the, uh... Ah! Thing. Come on, game. Just, just anticipate what I'm trying to do a little bit more, please. Just, just please, figure out what I'm trying to do here. There's an Irish band called Flogging Molly. Lucky <laughs> Molly. Certain length of belt thing is 
really fucking frustrating. It's like, oh no, gravity only exists sometimes. Yeah. It's like, oh yeah, you can totally have a floating bus, but no, floating belts are improbable. <laughs> Like, I get putting a building limit on it. So, hey, try not to build 20,000 in a row because your computer will crash. Like, that makes sense. But for me to have to put a fucking support every 20 goddamn meters because... I don't know. It's just because, I guess. I wonder if that's a... Yeah. That's... Hmm. It's absolutely a limit of what the engine can do because if you said hey place a belt here walk to the other side of the map and say place the end here it would just go Hurr. yeah i think you are correct i think this yeah the game's like nah how about nah not today not shitting on the game being unable to do it like that i could totally understand that being very hard for a game to calculate that amount of shit um, surprisingly, I don't think so. I just think that maybe it was a coding thing at the beginning of this early access so that they would, they could get like a bit of a workaround to it. But I reckon as the game progresses and they've got the coding sorted, I think, I think they could just be eliminated to be honest, but they won't, but one would think. Um... Copper, copper, copper sheets? No copper sheets? Uh, no, I do not believe copper sheets. No copper oh! sheets. Oh, oh my god, I thought I was going to fall there, and I panicked, and I nearly ran off the fucking edge of the cliff. That was funny. Oh, I did! Oh, fuck. Mm -mm. I managed to catch myself on the ladder. Good thing I had my nut in hand. Uh, uh, uh. One hand catch them. One hand, one bounce. Wait, is this the only system where the f brain work? It's K. Oh, I see. Gee. Hmm. Forgive the spaghetti, which is required. Oh, I fell again! <laughs> Not as far, luckily. You sure you haven't started drinking? No comment. <laughs> I probably should, and that will get rid of my headache, I feel. Like a big I mean, old temporarily. Of like, I think that's what it is. I think I've had a bit of a binge week, and I've had a fair bit of sugar, and I think I'm coming down with sugar withdrawals. It's just a massive headache from sugar withdrawals. probably now listening to me and going fuck Ed that's not a thing oh it definitely is a thing hey um pro tip I think I've already told you this but you know when you get that bus all connected to the um to the other end where all those storage containers are mm -hmm. please do them one at a time do them one at a time. Because if you connect all of those at once, uh, it might not crash, but... Or computer-wise. 
Yeah, so that's how we had to delete one of our worlds with another mate of mine because we did a very similar thing. We had like pretty much a similar design to what you've got. And then we just connected all the buses at once because we were like, oh, this should look really good. And then about four seconds later, we could not enter the world again. And we had to delete the world. I connect them all at once. Do you mean do it all in one go? or As in, like, I, I would imagine what you're talking about is sort of like having it all disconnected from the power so nothing's actually running and then you plug the power in and then everything should turn on simultaneously. Kind of, yeah. What we did was we had everything pipe up to basically the similar to the bus and then we just went along with conveyor belts and went connect, 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 connect for like 20 different things, stood back and then it just lagged the world out because we had everything piped up there which means none of the machines were working up to the bus and then when we connected it all this the game had to think of piping everything to the buses and then running the whole system simultaneously and it crashed the world <laughs> we just couldn't load we just could not load the world we had to just delete the world and start again so i mean yeah just just be careful just just, just don't just, I mean, do it if you really want. Just copy the copy the world and have like a second save file. But meanwhile, demons in your computer catches fire. Ah, uh, yeah. Just a wee, just a wee bit. Any use for power slugs other than the power shot? Just upgrading shit. Ooh, uh, there's research sometimes, isn't there? There is research, yeah. Well, I have done all the power slug research. Then. Oh, uh, there I was thinking that power slugs gave different levels of power shot, but uh, a higher level slug just gives you more power shot. Oh, yeah, okay, so instead of a green one giving you a single green shot, a yellow one would give you a yellow shot will give you shot. Yeah. <sighs> now that's going mildly faster. Okay, I just realized I play the beacon that I placed for the crash slot. My illiteracy fucking kicked my ass. It's not crash slot, it's crash shit. Oh, I have to drag the thing. Oh, okay. Come on, stop making this one and go fast. I think I barely made that fucking jump. There we go. Go here we go. Go. Oh, here we go again. Uh oh. Um, what did you did? Mm, mm, Are you slingshotting us into a fucking wall? No, but you guys haven't got the awesome sink yet, have you? Sink? Fuck! I think we did. What's the sink? The awesome sink? No. Oh boy. Isn't that the thing awesome. that we put all our extra shit into and it makes it into awesome shit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It prints out tickets and you can put them into the coupons and the coupon you buy the thingies. Did you guys make that yet? I swear Man. we did. No, no, that's no, no, that's different. The awesome sink is something like if you've got excess material, you just dump it into the awesome sink, and then it builds up coupons, and then you can use the coupons to buy 
things you can't unlock in game so whenever the developers make something cool they're like hey we've developed something cool but it's not in a patch yet let's put we it absolutely in absolutely have that do you where yeah. i don't think we've uh, got we'll one though build a special we haven't built it yet. oh uh, have you built got stuff for it i can build them for you now if you like no it's gonna take a while um the awesome thing oh you have yeah. to build up enough stuff to yeah, so essentially, to get a k ticket, you basically the idea is that you just go out to where a node is, like a, I don't know, like an iron node or something, and mine the iron node and convert it into, I don't know, sheets or something like that. And, and then what? You, and just dump it in there and just leave it be and just come back like in a day and you're just like, hey, I've got seven tickets and then you go and buy stuff with it. Oh, fun. Um, but until then, um, that's fine. I can work what kind that. of stuff can you buy from it? Um, so you can buy better, like wall-mounted um, power cabling, wall-mounted um, hypertube supports, um, a glass ceilings, glass foundations, corners, curved walls. Um, fuck, what else is there? Oh, uh, the Cybertruck is in there. They developed a Cybertruck for the game. <laughs> um, there's a whole bunch of shit. And you can also buy materials from it too. So like if you just dump a whole bunch of shit and then you're like, fuck, I need like uh, steel or something, you just walk up there, put a coupon in and be like, all right, I'll buy like five stacks of steel or something if you need it in a pinch. Shit like that. Sounds like I should go set that up sooner rather than later. Yeah. I'll come give you a hand because I can't progress this until that happens. So, sure. There's a uh, iron mine on the way to the coal plant, so I'll just make some Georges quickly, if I can remember how to do that. Wouldn't it be better to be completely automated? But you need Georges to build the mining things. Oh, yes, true. I oh, know this one's testing you. <laughs> we played with the foundry yet, dude? With the Let's foundry. Help. Yeah. I don't know what you're referring to, I'm afraid. Okay, don't worry. There's no need to worry. be afraid. I'm really bad at fucking not launching myself into the air to get to the fucking goop pad. Goop pad. Not launching yourself into the air to get to the goop pad. Like just dropping off the edge instead of jumping off the edge. <laughs> right. Not getting enough distance. Yeah.
I'm watching this 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 live recording of an Irish this this the, so Flog and Molly, um, is an Irish band. <laughs> He's like, I'll give a Guinness out to anyone who can catch it in the crowd if I can kiss your girl. And he just tosses it into the crowd and he just gets a kiss from a girl in the crowd. And the Irish are fucking the best. <laughs> this dude just catches it. This chick's like, oh, okay, fair enough. <laughs> oh, I love it. Fuck yeah. I'm moving to Ireland. <laughs> I don't think that's an Irish thing. I think that's a uh, I'm in a band thing. <laughs> Dude skulls the Guinness, mind you. I can tell you fucking that. <laughs> that's like once again that do that I've been watching. It's the same thing. Like he's on chat roulette, and all these women are just fucking like, oh fuck, they they love him. Mm. It's like it's only because they know what he can do with his fingers. Yeah. <laughs> So damn, this guy can finger a guitar really well. What else can he finger? <laughs> Not just buttholes. Um, are you guys close to uh, the base? I am. Who what do you need? That? No, why? Okay. What do you need? I need a proof of concept. I need a test dummy. I need a test dummy. Sounds like demon. And I need. Yeah. I've already been subject in the last what in the last week. Come hither, sir. Well, maybe you should come hither first. Because I'm oh, currently. No. I'm, oh, I fucked up. Oh, I see you up there. Shaking that ass. Oh, well, <laughs> there it is. Actually, where's the steel? I'm, I think I'm in the wrong direction for steel, aren't I? Yes. Oh no, steel's over there. Number one. Close enough, fish? No, steel's like behind the elevator. It is southeast. It's pink. Steel stuffs. Oh man, Udrid's out there. Wait, let me check this map. Why can't I check Why the map? Tried. Okay, and it can't. I can't have my tool out and all the map. Which is not that far out there. He's not even by the power plant. Yes. Demon. I Come jump in my hole. Well, best invitation I've had in years. <laughs> Run out of concrete. That's not for a long time. Run into that. The left hand one? Yes, sir. So, left hand's accelerator. Goodbye. Okay, oh, oh, my God. I'm gonna die! <laughs> Judging by the reaction, it worked. Alright. Uh, I, knew, I knew I was gonna get launched, but I was expecting there to be some sort of jelly pad. No, I just wanted to make sure none of this clogged up. Understandable. Did, where did you <laughs> Okay. Can I have 200 things to make a goo bag? Because apparently need? I need 200 uh, biomass. Uh, I can grab some for you. And then I'll jump out there. <laughs> Hang on, I'll, I'll pop down a power pole as a guide to where it was. That's where I landed. Okay, cool. Biomass. No, that's sulfur. Leaves. God, why can't I find biomass? You probably haven't got any. No, it's over here somewhere. Oh. 
solid biofuel? Uh, the stuff that you need for the green slop. How much do you need? I need 200 for a green slop. <laughs> Well, it looks like I'm making some biomass. Alrighty. On my way. From Ms. Venus. Richard's the... back. Richard. I run out of conquest. That's my thing. How far away am I going to end up? Not far. It's fine. Just uh, make sure you're holding some nuts. Do I need to go out there? Uh, just follow. Like, if you launch yourself, it it put me from full health to one bar, so it nearly killed me. Oh. Hmm. So if you just walk out there, you'll see a power pole that I jammed on the ground. That's where I landed. Well, I died. Told you not to fucking do it. Yeah, I was mid-air when that happened, though. My bad. That, that sounds like a personal problem. Oh! Oh, now Uhtred's gone and done it. <laughs> Uhtred, did you also die? Oh. Very cleverly, I was eating nuts as I flew. <laughs> Good news, on my dead body, <laughs> some biomass. Well, but I, left it. I left it so you could collect it. The initial um, launch is horrifying. Yeah. A bit jank, yeah. That was sulfur. So what do I need to do? Quit. No, I've oh, already got... You... Yeah. Oh, you already made it. Okay. I am on point, my friend. Cool. I just really wanted to make sure that the um the launcher didn't get like jammed. Yeah, understandable. So it sounds like it's a thing that totally happened in this game all the time. Tell you. Done. All right. So now, um, mm. uh, are you working on the awesome sink or do you want me to? You... I am starting it up here. Oh, holy shit sticks. Okay. Do you have a, uh, um, um, mm, a, um, a buffer? Uh, a storage, storage container in between what you're putting into the thing and the thing. Should I? Uh, yes, because if we've got some excess material we can just run over and just dump it in the storage container cunning rather than because there's no other way to just dump excess stuff in sorry da. sorry got that for you Uh, can I dump iron bars in, or should it be plates? And and no, anything. The more complicated the thing is to make, the more uh, speedy the coupons come pumping out. So I should probably make it into at least a basic. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. I mean, you could just put ingots in if you wanted to, but it would take like a whole day just to give you like one or two coupons.
motherfucker. What do you need? I've used two of my reinforced iron plates making something here, so now I don't have enough to actually build the awesome Uh. A second, I'll get you sorted. How many reinforced iron plates do you need? Two. Two. <laughs> Here you go, sir. Thank you. Dude, you should see the monstrosity I'm fucking creating. This is horrific. It hurts my soul. Added more stuff, guys. <laughs> oh. oh, wow. Oh, no. Oh, no, that's right. That's right. That's okay. It's all good. It's all good, though. Take it down. Go, my pretty. Crush everything. Yes. Eat our junk. Oh shit, Wink. that's actually gone pretty quick. It's a shame we can't add more... Um, more things into it. Yeah, eventually when you get um the faster conveyors, it works better, but it's alright. Have you had a look at the shop yet? Mm -hmm. They're all just tiny. This tiny. So how will be a little dude in there running the shop? <laughs> Street lights? Yeah. Oh, there's your ladders, dude. Fences? I could fence my little dog in instead of trapping him with horrible wall. <laughs> 
What is a fence but horrible walls? Walls. With holes in it. Conveyor wall? Oh, so you can load a conveyor through it. Genius. Mm hmm. Doors, always fun. Oh, we're so taken. Fucking tractor off the cooler pipe. Right. Fix it, factory car. What the fuck? Oh, yeah. It's a hoon machine, man. Is that the little suitcase car thing? Yup. It folds out and everything. Oh, I thought we fucking crashed then. My computer for us for a half second. That's pretty cool. Yeah. So yeah, whenever they develop something and they're just like, let's put it in the game, but we won't do it. We won't dedicate a whole patch to it or an update for it. They'll just put it in here. Yeah. And then eventually they'll do a massive patch and sometimes I'll take things out of here and then put it into the patch. Ship. What are we up to? One ticket yet? Yes, one coupon. Oh, you dumped a whole lot of shit in there. Oh, yeah. I was like, why are there bars going in and fucking plates coming out? It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> yeah, I just dumped a whole bunch of my, like, basic inventory in there. You put modular frames in there, and the thing spikes like fucking crazy. So, as you would also imagine, the more this ticks up, it the coupons get more and more expensive, obviously. But when you reset the coupons by printing them out, it doesn't reset the cost of the next coupon. So, like, eventually you'll get to, like, oh, it costs 30,000, I don't know, points, I guess you could say, to get one coupon. You print them out, and then it's like, but the next coupon costs 40,000. Thank you very much. And you're like, yeah. fuck. Yeah, and, I just takes days and days. What the if something like what happened? But well, then we'll have a bus up and run. Yeah, we can put modular frames in. Oh yeah, you just actually. I wonder if you could put nuclear waste in this. Huh. Interesting. Never thought about that. How many coupons do you need? Two coupons, sir. Do you want to 
you want to do you want to buy the thing I need to buy? And then you can buy it. Sure. Yeah. It's an experience printing the coupons. <laughs> you print, printed the coupons. Go print the coupons. There you go. Oh, I got some coupons. And then we need hypertube wall attachments. To the car, right? No, no. The car costs 10 coupons. What I'm hearing is you need 12 coupons. So. Hey. Woo! Thank you. Happy Dacky bouncing off into the distance. <laughs> I just looked at the time. Um, mm. Yeah, I was, I'm just having the same problem, unfortunately. I went to look at the time and then my eyes went cross eyed. Mm. Richard, where are you? Are you here at all or are you not here? You're not here, are you? you... I'm over here, why? Okay, come have a look at the bus. It's doing things. What is this? I love how pretty the splitters and uh, balancers look. It's a balancer. You don't yeah. use balancers? So, it seems that you can only, I can only do balancers as like a 2 to 2 or a 3 to 2. Or, sorry, a 2 to 2 or a 3 to 3. Or a 3 to 2 or a 2 to 3. Why? Or else it gets way too fucking complicated and there's more maths than I can deal with. But you could go up and down. What? You can, you can build vertically. Yeah, but it's... I can... It's like because there's only like one in and three out or three in and one out. Like to do more requires more complication than I can't be bothered. Part of me is very pleased that this works and the other part of me hates it. Which part? What are you looking at? The splitter or which? The splitter. Yeah. I like that the patterns combined as well. Pretty. Oh, building shit. Got some screw pipes to the plate. So for, um, like, phase two materials, so like the the reinforced plates that require screws and plates. Well, I'll build well, further that, out. That's that's this one here. This one's making that for us. That's making reinforced plates. Uh, it should be, aren't you? Doesn't have enough iron. Iron plates. Oh, it's getting there. That'll be the throughput. Let's do it up. Moist. And you 
you go up the ladders to the, the copper level. Well, not the ladder, the um, the ramp, because ladders apparently don't exist. They yeah, do they in do. the awesome store. I haven't seen this awesome store, so therefore it can't be awesome. It can only be <laughs> pretty decent. So it's much the same, except where the iron comes down. Oh, sorry, the steel comes down. Steel products, where it sort of mixes, I think looks pretty fucking sick. So from up high, this little area looks sick. It does look pretty epic. Oh, fuck, I thought I fell off the edge of the world then, I was gonna look, fucking cry. Alright boys, I'm gonna have to call it, I got work in the morning. What? Yeah. A weekend. Mm. Yeah, well, mm -hmm. Fucking retail. Mm -hmm. You know why they call it retail? Because you really tail it. <laughs> I don't know, that was a bad joke I was trying to make up on the spot and it did not work. <laughs> That's boss semi-plugged in. Nice. So I'm thinking do some more steel extraction and uh, then I can do the encased steel beams. And I can't remember what else I need. Yeah, that steel plant there is running off just the one coal thing, so it's not going to produce a huge amount. One coal? I got that one. I don't even know where I got that fucking tick from. It's, um, Achievement Hunter. Oh, okay. Anyway, have a good night, guys. Oh, see you around. Catch you, Ducky. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. If you have something that you wish to change or uh, put some notes down, now would be the time. No, looks good. You happy for a save and a shutdown? Oh, I see what you mean. Um, yes, I'm just gonna. But you are happy with the bus by the sound of that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What else are we gonna do? Um, okay. Uh, anything else we need to do? Continue working on the bus. Because I'm thinking I'll put concrete up with this steel plant, and then I can have that encased steel. I can go in next to everything else. Uh, excuse me. Yep. Yeah. And after that, I... Uh... Can you directly upgrade belts? Yes. Nice. can't remember how, but I remember doing it once. I think you just hold, like, you get the Mark II belts in your hot slot, and then you just click on it, like the upgrade tool. Oh... Got bigger handrail. It clearly means shit's moving fast. Alright, yeah, you better save it before I start doing something.
It is saved. Rookie. What was it that you were going to do that scared you? Oh, um, I've been putting stuff into my molecular analysis machine. Uh, so if I start a research, then we wait five minutes for the research to What stuff do you need in your molecular research machine? I mean, um, I need 70 more molecular frames that will take, not molecular frames, modular frames that will take fucking forever. Yeah, to cool. unlock the explorer, which I assume is what Daki means when he's talking about a Junebug. 